Special teams play seems more routine than anything until they don't work. Then breakdowns can cost games. The Cougars are optimistic that this group will be special in a variety of ways this fall. True Blue's Robbie Bolo reports. Seven of the ten full-time coaches on the BYU football staff are either new to the team or have new assignments from a year ago, including Nick Howell, who moves from coaching the linebackers to the secondary and also takes over the special teams with coach Patrick Higgins' departure to Purdue. So what makes Howell so qualified to lead the special teams? You have to ask Coach Men and all that. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I'm willing. I'll work hard. Coach Howell is more than capable and has punter Riley Stevenson returning to pin opponents deep. But unlike last season, Stevenson can focus on punting as his kickoff duties transfer to Justin Sorensen, who recently returned from serving an LDS mission. Post-mission leg uh, feels good. It, uh, it's tired sometimes, but overall it feels pretty good. You know, two years of rest definitely does the body some good, so it's ready to go. It'll definitely lighten the load, that's for sure, so I can focus more on punts. Justin by far has stronger leg, I think, and so it's good to have him back. Sorensen feels his leg is stronger than ever, even after surgery for an ankle injury forced him to come home for a few months during his mission. He replaces BYU's all-time leading scorer, Mitch Payne. Usually special teams are fine if they go unnoticed, so BYU wants to avoid what happened last year at Utah. BYU a chance to beat Utah on the final play of the game. The snap to Horning, the hold is good, the kick is blocked and Utah wins it. And Utah's won it on a blocked field goal on the final play of the game. Every snap of play of special teams is every bit as important as a snap on defense or a snap on offense. And so that mindset has to be created and it's consistency and just doing your job. It's nothing magical. It's just doing your job and executing. Robbie Bolo, True Blue.